Welcome to the Green Gold series. Another week, a new episode. So remember last time we talked about the need for using well compost manure. That is very important so that the plant, the nutrients in the manure are available to the plant immediately. Now this is how we do it. To begin with, you have a quarter of EM. essential microorganisms which you mix with one liter of molasses and 20 liters of water so this you mix it well and keep it for 14 days for the fermentation process to happen but in a jerry can that is closed. We had already prepared uh, one 14 days ago for these purposes and so we'll demonstrate how then you spread it on the manure. So you have to spread it in a way that it's not getting very wet but it's just mixing to make sure that it's getting to the bottom and once that is done, then this manure is covered for another 14 days for the fermentation to happen. After 14 days or during that period, you'll find that the manure becomes very, very hot. And after that, then it stops getting hot. That tells you that the process of fermentation or breaking down of the nutrients has happened. And that manure is ready to go to the farm. Basically, then your plant will access the nutrition value that is in the composted manure better as opposed to when you use the raw manure. So once you have access to such manure that is well composted, then that means you can be able to balance your use of synthetic fertilizer and organic fertilizer because this has been broken down in a form that is also easily available to the plant. And that brings us to the end of this episode where we demonstrated how you compost your manure to the point that the nutrients are easily accessible to your plants. Look out for the next episode and keep subscribed.